Before we begin, I'd like all the inductees to rise so that we may recognize them. It is through a great deal of hard work, effort, and commitment that you are all here today. Let's give them a round of applause. Also, would all family, friends, and guests please stand? You, uh oh, <laughs> I still got more to say. Um, <laughs> you are the support and the background of these outstanding young artists, and you are all with equal amount of recognition. Inductees, would you please turn towards our guests and applaud them? That's all the standards. Um, so, for those of you that do not know me, I'm Sean Bianchi, or Mr. Bianchi to my students. For three years, I have known or taught the vast majority of these students, parents. I'd like to take this opportunity to apologize for sending your children home covered in charcoal, <laughs> with paint stains, wearing a band-aid, having glazed over eyes from staring at computer monitors, <laughs> or for having to listen for them to complain about that project that took so long to create. Pointillism. Also, anything negative they have ever said about me is a complete lie. <laughs> I'd also like to take a moment to acknowledge the other members of our department. As I call your name, would you please stand so that we may recognize you? Uh, Mrs. Contos, <laughs> the most fashionable member of our department. Mrs. Cohen, beloved photography teacher. Mrs. Chow, the, sun the sunshine of our department. And although she couldn't be here, Mrs. O'Leary, our versatile studio teacher. And last but not least, our fearless leader and department head, Dr. Lucy Prodzik. It is through her support and confidence in all of us that we are able to deliver the best possible art education at Somerville High School. Let's give her an extra round of applause. For you. Dr. Project also deserves recognition for helping us to establish this chapter of the National Art Honor Society. When she gave us an informational packet on this idea at the beginning of the year, Mrs. Contos and I jumped at the idea. Unfortunately, we do not offer any honors or AP courses in the arts. Thus, we saw an opportunity to acknowledge the outstanding efforts of our students and as a way to keep them coming back for more. And that is how the events leading to today began. We wrote chapter bylaws, consulted other honor societies, had selection drawings, meetings, and finally, we selected all of you. All of you are here because your strong artistic abilities and personal motivation has pushed you to artistic excellence. You have come a long way since your first artistic endeavors in this life. Drawing on the walls, <laughs> finger painting, elbow macaroni necklaces, doodling during math class, or like myself, the first time you ate spaghetti and turned yourself into an abstract painting. <laughs> My parents still have those pictures. The development of an artist is a very special and unique process. It requires the right amount of encouragement, the vision to create worlds that don't exist or to recreate our own, the technical ability to translate the amazing ideas in your head onto the blank paper or canvas before you, an enormous amount of practice as there is no substitute for experience, and lastly, the passion to create artwork and continuously improve your craft. The last being the most important, as without passion, art loses its meaning, and trust me, you are all very passionate, or else you would not be here today. Parents, family, and friends, thank you for supporting everyone here in their artistic efforts. Some would have the world believe that the arts are insignificant, that the world would continue without art. The fact is, the world is comprised of art, and continues to evolve based on art. It's not a program of study, it's not a class, it's not a major. Art is a living and breathing entity that we all contribute to. The oldest surviving records of society are not written in books. 
They are recorded on, and painted on the walls of caves in Europe. These depict everyday tasks and what animals were available for hunting. Even now, amongst the clothes that we wear, the cars we drive, the phones we play Angry Birds on in class, <laughs> and where we live is all thanks to art. Thank you, parents, family, and friends for supporting our students' pursuits of, in fine arts. <laughs> Inductees, you are all outstanding representatives of Somerville High School and our art department. There are two massive feats I would like us to recognize from this year that you have all helped to accomplish. The first is establishing this chapter, which we expect will grow and expand with each following year. The second is the senior class gift this year, which is this mural over to my left. This mural was designed and drawn by the art club and the National Art Honor Society. Throughout the past month, many of you have also been painting it in my art major three and four, as well as my independent study courses. The subject matter of this mural is the evolution of Somerville from the time it was founded until its current era. This mural celebrates each phase of development in this city's history that has led to its rich cultural diversity. When completed in the next couple weeks, you guys heard me, right? Couple weeks. <laughs> it will be an amazing illustration of the pride of Somerville and its success that is owed to you all. It will be installed in the high school cafeteria and its title will be Progress. As we recognize that progress will always create new opportunities and brighter horizons. Please everyone, give our Honor Society members an applause for their outstanding efforts. Now, please join me in celebrating the accomplishments of these students by officially inducting them into the National Art Honor Society. Get your cameras and cell phones ready. When I call your name, Please come and receive your certificate and your tassel for graduation days if you are seen. All right. Aliana Aperasana. David, Chuku, no Chuku. Kervinson, excellent. Alexandra Wood. Last 
two, your tassels are on order. That's last minute additions. I'll give them to you at class day. Taylor Machado.